We will work on the ADXL 345 module. Uh, ADXL 345 is a 3-axis accelerometer module. So the features are like it has very low power consumption. The supply voltage is from uh, 2 volt to 6, 3.6 volt. And the temperature range is from uh, minus 40 to 85 degrees Celsius. Uh, it is small in size and it supports SPI and I2C interface. It has an uh, onboard voltage regulator, this one, and a voltage level converter. Um, it can measure values from minus 16G to plus 16G. Let's look at the pinout of ADXL345 sensor. The first one is the ground. Second one is the VCC. Third pin is the chip select. Uh, fourth one is the interrupt one out. And then we have interrupt two out. This is serial data out, serial data, and serial clock. So this was the pin out of the uh, module. At the center, if you see, this is the ADXL345 sensor. So this is the uh, sensor, the axis accelerometer, ADXL345, and this is the uh, ESP32 board, and it has this uh, GPIO. I can remove it and show you. So, these are the GPIO. If you can see, the, uh, it has all the pin names on it. So, let's uh, do the connection. Uh, so this is the 3.3, uh, the first pin. I will connect this to the uh, VCC of the sensor. Second is the ground. This is the ground. Now, um, the serial data is to be connected to GPIO 21. So beside this is the 23, 22. This is EX, RX, and then 21 GPIO. So GPIO 21 is connected to the serial data SPA. And finally, we have the uh, serial clock at 22 GPIO. So, this is how you can do the connection and then connect. Power the ESP32. Now uh, let's see the uh, programming part now. So this is our code. Uh, we need this libraries: y.h, Adafruit sensor, and Adafruit 345. So first, we will install these libraries. Uh, I already have this y.h. Uh, so I will install the other two libraries. So you need to go to sketch and then include libraries. Then you need to click on this manage li libraries. So it will open the uh, library manager. It will take some time to load as it is updating the uh, libraries so and uh, after that uh, click here and the search for adafruit uh, we need this uh, three four five Accelerometer as we are using the sensor. Install it. So now it is downloading the library and then it will install it. So 
we also need this uh, unified sensor libraries in my case it is installed but it's not updated so i will just click on this update once you are done with installing these libraries uh, you can click on this close and after that we have this uh, code we will now upload the code uh, for that you need to connect the ESP32 to your system and then go to tools then select the uh, ESP32 and then uh, click on this also select the com port and then you can click on this upload It is now uh, uploaded. Uh, so we need to click on this tools and then open this serial monitor. And you need to set the board rate. This is the value we are getting right now. And if I like so the values also changes in the same way so this is how the accelerometer works